South Dakota State may yet get more home playoff games, but if they do, they'll be in Sioux Falls at Howard Wood Field because what's left of Coughlin Alumni Stadium will be demolished immediately following today's final game ever. At the old stadium against Illinois State, members of the 1962 team that opened the place are on hand for the 289th and final game. First quarter, ISU score shown why they're the number two ranked team in the country. Trey Roberson to Anthony Warham for the touchdown. It was 7-0. Illinois State's only loss to unbeaten Iowa, but John Stigelmeyer's crew had something for him today. Jesse Bobbitt in the second quarter picks off the Roberson pass, sets up State deep in ISU territory. A few moments later, Taryn Christian Going to angle to the right side and score from 10 yards. He had over 300 yards of total offense in this game, and State has tied the game up at 7. Late in the half, Christian had to leave. He got the win knocked out of him. Zach Lujan in. Same result. Touchdown to Jake Winicky. 13-7 at half. Huge win for State. They say goodbye to Coughlin Alumni Stadium, 25-20.